all right hello everyone and peace of Christ to all of you uh, victory always in the name of the Lord and the Lord is our victory uh, today we made a video uh, respond to hijab who he claimed that he can debate me and he will finish me uh, but one of you sent me a debate so sent me a video of him uh, he is having an interview and in the interview they mention my name and they start insulting me and calling me Egyptian boy and saying they will not debate me here you you will notice right away that those guys they did not forget about Christian Prince they did not even sleep otherwise why are you go in an interview and you talk about Christian Prince if he is no one and if your victory is guaranteed is it going to be bad for you to take in your way one more <laughs> anyway I made a video and the link is down in the info down there please click on it you can watch it the title is Muhammad hijab and Ali Dawa Ali Dawa we need to fix the run there it doesn't matter really run like little girls from a Christian Prince and this is reality cowards and he starts saying oh we have our standard no 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 after the victory brother our brother he Allah he gave him we have our standard victory what victory you idiot what victory and who are you and they start calling me boy and they call me princess prince me I am the princess or zero prophet who is the one who wear his wife's skirt you are scared and you are terrified that be, you, you are going to be humiliated both of you cowards it's not your fault they think now they are a big guys they said oh after Allah the victory Allah gave us uh, uh, our brother here he proved he proved prove what prove he's proved that he is a stupid go and review and watch my videos I made for this guy everything he said is against Islam is going to get your prophet busted I'm very thankful for this debate with Muhammad with, with, with David Wood not because David Wood he did a good job but because your Muhammad hijab he was horrible and actually they are scared that I'm going to face them in that debate in what they said in the debate with David Wood a bunch of kids and only stupid they will believe that you are a person who have knowledge just I wanted to share this a small video with you and as it was expected they will make Tons of excuses not to get close to me. Now those Abdul's they have a standard. We became stars now. <laughs> Michael Jackson and uh, <laughs> we have a standard. <laughs> and now and now, brother, after he proved himself, we have a standard now. After, now to, yesterday they didn't have a standard. Today they have a standard. So why you said in the in the when the guy he challenged you, he said why you don't debate Christian Prince. You said I will finish him. Finish me. Cowards. Cowards. All of you. Again, it's a proven again and again that Muslims they have no courage. They have nothing but mockery. And they are calling me Egyptian boy. And the funny, both of them are Egyptian. I mean they are. They are insulting the Egyptians supposedly, but both of them are Egyptian. What is it? What do you mean by Egyptian boy? <laughs> Who is the boy? <laughs> they said the same word, but they did not call David Wood Egyptian. They called him boy. And supposedly they have a standard. If you have a standard, why you are calling a boy, calling a guy is debating you in a respectful way, you call him a boy in the debate official debate in a stage yet you use the word boy and mockery and stupidity you all of you are a bunch of boys and now because after you made the promise that you will debate me you went home and you calculate your numbers are we really going to debate christian prince are you serious do you know brother what is that going to do to you brother don't ever get close to christian prince this is not David Wood. You will not leave the debate unless you will be pieces. You need a lot of a glue to fix yourself after the debate. 
And I want the Muslims to ask him, well, what is going to hurt you if you bring one more victory to Islam, as long as you are victorious as you claim? What you will lose? Finish Christian Prince. Finish him. Are you, to, are you to the person who is going to do jihad for Allah? Who care? Do jihad, my friend. But because they are little tiny girls, they knew their size. There is people we should not get close to. Otherwise, we will be really, 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 really in a very horrible shape. And everybody will laugh at us. Anyway, I did my part. I challenged him. I made a video saying, I give you 10 days to name your day, your time. But the coward, they were thinking about it fastly. So they decided to make a video says, we will not debate the Christian Prince already. Please download the video, which you will see down in the info down. Under this video here, which means under the live broadcast, there's a video there I made for them. Please share it around. Post it on Facebook. Post it wherever you wish. And we continue. We continue and we expose this cult. And just today, we have a wonderful person who was a Muslim who left Islam and accepted Christianity. So do you see what you call him boy can do, my friend? Your Islamic cult is failing like a dead tree. And we are getting the good fruits from between the Muslims accepting Jesus. Just a few hours ago, actually not a few hours, I mean maybe an hour ago, we have a new brother who left the cult of Islam and he accepted Jesus. Who is the boy? We are the real men, my friend. The real boy is the one who believed in heaven there is vagina and there is long penis and he believed in fiction that women they will be inside the fruits that is a boy a, a person who believe in cartoon flying carpet hmm? flying yeah, you name it who is the boy so please download the video again it is under the info of this video download it share it around and let us get them busted and as you know, I'm not really, I'm not surprised that they decide they will never debate me. But you know, I just wanted to show the Muslims actually, because the Muslim, they say, uh, I can show you my Facebook right now. A Muslim, he says to me, Why you don't debate, uh, uh, you know, what's his name, uh, Muhammad Hijab? Do you dare to challenge debate here, Muhammad Hijab? He said that to me, My friend, I challenged, I challenged all the Muslims. I challenge the Muslims every day. Not only this guy, who is this guy? This guy is no one for me. I challenge the big guys and still they run away from debating me. So when a, when a Muslim Abdul, he says to me, why you didn't debate Muhammad Hijab? I laugh. Who said I will not? You see, my Skype is open every day. Who is holding anyone to call me? Why they don't call me? Nobody is holding you from calling me, my friend. Call me. Why you Muslims want to debate only certain kind of people who don't speak Arabic? Huh? Why? Simply because you are afraid. You are terrified. Otherwise, here we go. I'm here. Where is your scholar? Where is your where is the ones who have answers? Where is the people who have knowledge? I'm trying to find you where this guy he said to me why, why you don't debate Muhammad Hijab <laughs> why <laughs> I mean that would be the most funny thing ever I never say that I will not debate anyone you even you as a kid even hijab he is a small tiny he can call me everybody is welcome the problem you Muslims you see things, but you say, I don't see it. You play you play dumb when you want. You play blind when you want. Otherwise, there's no way you did not see me challenging all your Muslims who claim that they knew Islam. It's impossible. You are a person who come to my Facebook page, and yet you are saying to me, you did not see my, my videos posting to you Muslims challenging you almost every day.
that is impossible right hypocrisy is the way to run away from answering me or debating me and as long you guys you will make victory i mean what you will lose call me make victory bring victory to allah i am wait i cannot wait i mean are you telling me after all those years i am torturing islam we could not find one of you he can make a life call life debate without even telling me surprise me call me and show everybody that i know nothing after all those years not even one of you was able to stood to me and in my career so i want the abdul to ask themselves why this kid hijab and ali dawa who's asking for fifty thousand pound right away after the debate why they will not make a debate with the christian prince and then they will they will ask for one hundred thousand pound because imagine if you can get if you can get christian prince a career finish i mean brother that will bring you a lot of more money i mean if your debate with david price for it it's fifty thousand pound a month what said they expose islam if you click at that link down in the video there you will see i am i am posting other videos and actually it's in my facebook exposing the lies of those guys and showing that they cannot even be muslims you see a muslim he can lie to defend islam but a muslim he cannot make mockery of his prophet those people they made official mockery of their prophet they made fun of him they called him stupid because they said whoever believed that in what david would say it is a stupid it's a lot it's a lie watch it and be the judge and then you will understand why those muslims are running away i don't want to keep you here for long thank you very much for watching and again please uh no screen uh, what happened to the screen let me see what happened i'm not sure why that's weird okay hmm. that's kind of weird i don't know why let us see okay uh, look like i uh, we have a problem but anyway guys you get the idea uh, i think this is an error in youtube uh, you get the idea you can you can just go down that this video is just to tell you to go down in the link down there and watch it download it and share it around all right you hear my voice correct you 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 hear my voice i'm debating about islam before those those kids are even born before they are even born they are the kids but they are trying to insult just to run away when i was debating islam my friend this guy he did not know how to go to the bathroom his mother she was making milk for him And yet they are calling me a boy. Who is the boy? I am the Christian prince, and I am the one who your God Allah fear him to death. I am the one who your prophet who have no teeth feared to bite him because he lost his teeth. And because you're afraid that they will lose your teeth if you try to use them with me, this is why you decide to stay away from me. Thank you guys for being here. Again, this video is made just to make you click at the video down there, watch it, share it, and get them busted. Thank you, and God bless. Take care.